Chocolate is the most craved food among women, and men have been known to be pretty obsessed too. But can a person be addicted to chocolate? When people crave chocolate or any other specific food, it's not usually born of genuine hunger. Instead, cravings are often related to external stimuli like a party or a holiday or to emotions like boredom, anxiety, and sadness. After satiating a craving for chocolate, many people report feeling happier. In many women, the craving occurs on a monthly cycle which suggests a hormonal basis. This partly explains the cravings common in seasonal affective disorder, SAD, and premenstrual syndrome. The reason for this may be that foods high in sugar and fat, like chocolate, cause a person's brain to release a flood of serotonin, which is a brain chemical responsible for positive thoughts and pleasurable sensations. In addition, Northwestern University researchers found that self-proclaimed chocoholics experienced increased blood flow to certain parts of the brain, particularly the orbital frontal cortex and midbrain. Researchers note that these are the same areas associated with addictive drugs like alcohol and cocaine. And it's also a fact that people who claim to be addicted to chocolate are more likely to be addicted to alcohol, cigarettes, gambling, and sex. Still, most experts agree that chocolate is not addictive in the true sense of the word, which is to be physically or psychologically dependent on something. After all, the feel-good chemicals present in chocolate are significantly lower than those in less craved foods like broccoli. It's more likely that chocolate cravings stem from the fact that the treat is highly desirable, yet for health reasons should be eaten with restraint. Over-enthusiastic chocolate fans may benefit from analyzing why they want to eat and then taking steps to address the real problem. For example, a bored person could play cards while a sad one might call a friend. Chocoholics may also consume less if they keep chocolate out of the house and stock up on healthy, easy to grab snacks as replacements. Chocolate fiends may even find that regular exercise reminds them of the chocolate high as physical activity releases similar feel good chemicals in the brain. In the end, remember, chocolate won't kill you, but it won't extend your life either. Consume in moderation.